What's up guys, it's Unders, and in today's video, I wanna share something for you guys out there who maybe haven't spent the money on tools yet, and but are maybe reaching the limit of your DAW, and there's some certain things you'd like to do, but you haven't got the bank to go and buy all the latest UAD waves, the big name plugins. In this video, I'm gonna share three free EQ plugins that I think could be really useful for you and your music. Let's go. All right, so number one is from the guys at Tokyo Dawn Labs, and it is the Slick EQ plugin, and the reasons I like it. Yeah, if you don't know about this EQ, you should probably download it. Now, I personally, I own the Gentleman Edition, which is the paid version. However, the free version is a beautiful three-band EQ. It allows you to do some really smooth curves. Um, it describes itself as sort of silky and mellow, different stages of uh, the way you can put it out. You can even add saturation directly into the EQ. You have EQ Sat, which simulates uh, pushing it on a, a desk. It kind of goes for that analog simulation. And then you've got different versions of the EQ as well. So they have what's called British, American, German, Soviet. And basically what this does, it adjusts the curves and the profile. It's emulating different types of EQ channels across different desks and their saturation. Uh, and then the fact that you can change it from bell to high and low shelves, adjust across your three bands. It's nice and low on CPU. Just if you want some characterful EQ rather than the, the standard ones that come with your DAW, you know, this is just a really great option to throw in there and have a bit of a characterful EQ saturation and an EQ I definitely recommend downloading. Yeah, I've been using Slick EQ for quite a while. I think one of my first videos on this channel showed using that EQ uh, and I was using it on, I guess, the Lessons Learned album, probably. It's a really great tool if you want to add some character into your track uh, and you know, a bit of saturation, a bit of an analogy feel, especially if you're working with samples and some instruments that can sound super digital. You can use that EQ, get the profile you're after and just kind of character it up a little bit. Number two. Right, so the second one that I recommend you check out, the Blue Cats Triple EQ for these reasons. Because it has a feature that you won't necessarily find, and in some cases you don't have it in your door, which is the ability to do mid-side processing. I and mean, if you're not sure what that is, there'll be a link below for a video that explains some good uses of it. But essentially think of it like this. If you've got a piece of audio that's uh, stereo, it's got left and right, but there's something really in the center, like my vocal would be right now, you could switch that to mid side mode and you could adjust the center of that kind of mix, that piece of audio. And for example, you could bring my vocal down using something like a mid side EQ. And I know some DAWs don't have that option by default. For example, Logic, you can switch it to left or right and you can kind of uh, do some routing to make a mid side EQ, but it's great to just have a switch and be able to use it and it's a really useful mixing tool and uh, using the triple eq from blue cat here just gives you that option right out the bag completely free for when you need to bring that tool into use to the third one, I just want to share a quick bit from our channel sponsor, DistroKid. And these guys will help you get your music out to all of the streaming platforms. They do it quickly and efficiently. I've been using them for many, many years. There's support there if you need it. And you know what? You can do it at a really nice starting budget of just about $20 a year and keep it well within a, an affordable budget for a starting artist. All right, so EQ number three is a Pultec EQ, something I recommend you have in your arsenal to use. I love using it on vocals and some like organic sounds. It just has a really big warm profile. This is Warmy, check it out. From Kive Audio and it's an emulation of a Pultec and it's by far the best free emulation I found out there. In my opinion, it's even better than the free ones that are bundled inside Logic, which is just ironic. Now I'm a huge fan of the Pultec EQs. I own the Waves one, the IK one, uh, as well as the UA and I use all of them because they all sound ever so slightly different, which was the nature of this. And this just adds another one to the arsenal. It gives us the ability to do like the, the low cut, the high cut, 
the multiple high frequency selectors so we can do the boost and dip around the same frequency and um, it's nicely oversampled it just sounds really really good a pull tech eq is some, something you should definitely have in your arsenal it's a really old school bit of kit but it works really really well on natural sounding things like vocals that's where i almost always use it uh, it does a really really great job and as a free tool if you don't have any of the other options i already mentioned you should absolutely download it and make use of it Okay, right, so that is three free EQs that I recommend you check out because they've all got different characteristics and tool sets that can just help you further a little bit more than what is in most DAWs out there. And you can just use it for a bit better sound creation and going a little further in your mixing. I hope that's been helpful for you and giving you some ideas and I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video.